6th on ABC. It's going. There it goes. Breaking news. Two cars plunge into that 20-foot sinkhole, and on the 15 freeway, a fire truck swallowed whole. The strongest storm of the season slamming San Diego. It's causing problems up and down the coast. That powerful wind also knocking over dozens of trees, one even crushing a home, and we're not done yet. 10 News begins with the 10 News breaking weather alert. 10 News is across the county as well as Southern California covering the wrath of this storm. Let's begin with our 10 News anchor Brian Schlonsky with the massive sinkholes that swallowed a fire truck and several cars. Brian. Yeah, guys, both of these in different spots of rain drenched Los Angeles. So let's start with this one, the fire truck. This is video that you just got to see. This is a San Bernardino truck. You see it there. It's on the side of the 15 freeway in the Cajon Pass, and now you don't see it. The road gave out. Thankfully, those firefighters had already escaped the truck. All right, now let's take you to that sinkhole in Studio City. Two cars plunged into that 20-foot sinkhole. You see the second one going in right there. This is near Laurel Canyon Boulevard and Woodbridge Street. And another thing you need to check out here, the water underneath those cars, it's just rushing. That first car actually had a woman inside. And if I bring you back here inside the 10 News Live Center, I can show you how she escaped. Fire crews had to put a ladder into the hole. There they are pulling her out of there. At this point, she has been taken to the hospital. We don't know how bad her injuries are. That second car, thankfully, no one inside. At this point, firefighters have wrapped off that hole, so nobody can get to it. They're trying to get the cars out, but look, that's going to be tough. This photo, we just found it a few minutes ago. Look at that. Now the cars, you can't even see them. You saw the second one was poking out of that hole a few minutes ago. Now it's gone, too, so the uh, task is on to remove the cars. One woman taken to the hospital, guys. So much damage tonight. I am here with 10 News meteorologist Angelica Campos. So what is the storm doing now, and what about tomorrow?